Hey, what's up guys? Hope you're having a good day. Got a quick little octane tip for you. So if you put in a primitive, like a cube, we have some options for adding a fillet to it. So you can add a fillet and add a really nice beveled edge to it, something like this. There's a couple problems with this. Not all of your primitives or objects have that fillet option. Another one is that it adds a bunch of uh, polygons and subdivision, making your scene more dense. So I found this really cool thing in Octane where you can add um, fillets to any object, but it's part of the material, so it's not actually adding more subdivision, meaning it's not gonna make your scene more dense. It's pretty interesting. So let's throw on a new glossy material, and we'll make this a nice blue color. And we'll throw this onto our object here. So if we go into our Platonic, we don't actually have an option for rounding the edges with a fillet or anything like that. But if we go into our material, if you go down to this common section, we actually have this rounded edges slot. So if we kick this up to one centimeter, you can see that we're adding a really nice bevel to the edge of our platonic. And you can do this on any object. The really nice thing is this is not making our scene any more dense or adding polygons. And we can kick this up and make it even more extreme. Pretty cool little feature here. I would definitely recommend using this if you're in Octane and uh, definitely play around with that. So hopefully that helps you guys out. As always, thank you for checking out the Pixel Lab. We'll talk to you next time. Ciao.